G'day, welcome back to the vlog everyone. <laughs> oh, I'm well excited today. Today we get to cruise, cruising, cruising, cruising. Oh, I'm so thrilled to be back. Oh, I'm more thrilled to be able to go. Today's going to be the first day we're going to take the boat out for a cruise. It's the start of the long weekend here in Britain. Easter for everyone. Um, well, I'm not religious at all, but <clears throat> um, Duncan's with me. My partner, he's not working, so we've got like three or four days together. Um, we can just relax and chill. I've got some steak. Bought some steak. We have a uh, towpath barbecue later. <clears throat> yeah, I don't do fish on Good Friday. I couldn't give a shit, actually. Um, um, so I'm well excited today. It's going to be an absolutely, it already is, a smashing day out. We're going to have like tops of 19, 20 degrees. It's just going to be beautiful. It, look, it is already. A bit of sun shining. Um, it's hardly a cloud in the sky. It's just wonderful. Just, oh, what a time to be on the canals, eh? <clears throat> so, um, yeah. Here's to another cruise. Here's to another season. It's going to be bloody awesome this year. So, my plan is to, well, we're just going to go probably up to rugby just for a few days. Um, just nowhere, because I've got to get some more work done. I'm getting a new grease gun. Um, or grease pump installed down at Calcutt next week. It was supposed to be this week, but half their engineers are off because of coronavirus, so they've delayed it by a week. Um, just fine to take the boat out for a bit of a cruise, and then come back to Calcutt, get that done. Then I'm going to Oxford. It's been on my bucket list. For those of you who've been watching me um, for the past several years, you'll realize, you'll remember that I got stuck on the Napton flight on my little cruiser. Um, but this time I'll hopefully get through the Napton flight and down to Oxford. It's been on my bucket list for years. Um, so that's um, destination number one. After that, I feel the north calling again. I really want to go back to Manchester um, via Wales because that's another place that's been on my bucket list. Remember, I also got stuck in the bottom lock there. Um, the, is it Helston Lock? I think it is. Um, yeah, on the Langoflin Canal. So <clears throat> that too has been on my uh, bucket list of places I want to visit. So I'm going to knock both of those over this season. And then I think I'm going to head to Manchester. I just feel the call of the north again. Because <laughs> remember, that's where we uh, emigrated to, where we moved to, where we moved to, moved to England, moved to Manchester, and I, I love Manchester. It's just absolutely beautiful. Um, so yeah, that's from up to. Oh, and by the way, um, after a lot of consideration, I have decided to start up my Patreon site again. So last year I was doing a lot of um, live streams, live cruise streams. I've got my don't forget I've got my boat cam. Here's my boat cam over here. Right, there's my little boat cam. So I've decided rather than just do it all publicly, um, I've, I've kind of lost my sponsors. I had four, remember? Um, sort of three have fallen off the radar. Um, and Charlie, you all remember Charlie? Well, he's kind of not a sponsor anymore. He's actually become a best mate. Um, would you believe it's um, wonderful? He's a wonderful guy and we've clicked you know, so, um, yeah, so he's kind of become a more best mate, rather, I don't call him a sponsor anymore, he's a mate, he's a friend, so, um, but it's not about the money with Patreon for me, it's more about giving me something else to do, really, <laughs> um, and sharing my life with those who actually value my contribution, rather than just the general public, if that makes sense, you know what I mean, like, I really appreciate all your comments, um, that I've received, especially in my, uh, over my trip to Australia. Um, but uh, now I just want to sort of take it all, kind of make it a little bit more private, a little bit more personal and intimate. Do you know what I mean? So I'm going to be offering all of my... So I've got two tiers. I've got a supporter tier at £2 a month and a boating tier at £5 a month, plus fat. You've got to charge fat for some reason. Anyway, um, I don't charge fat. It's just Patreon does it. Um... <clears throat> so if you're a boater and you want to know everything that I do on my boat, so I'll be covering things like, well, you'll get boat access to boat cam, all my boating DIY, boat recipes, um, I'm going to be reviewing canal side pubs, marinas is another one, <laughs> um, so all that sort of stuff, you know, live streams, I'm going to be taking all that and making it patron only now. 
So um, if you want to support me, um, you can either do it, yeah, two pounds a month or five pounds a month or whatever, and um, help me out. It just helps me recover my costs a little bit as well with a website because I've had, you know, it's cost me a fair amount of money to host the website. Um, and um, yeah, so I'm really doing it for the sort of that and also give me something else to do. <laughs> Um, yeah, I've not really been a fan of social media and sharing my life with a whole bunch of people I don't know, so I'd rather create a little community of people that I get to know over the course of the next few years um, and share my life with them. So if you are interested, jump onto my Patreon site, look out for me, Aussie Boda, um, or I'll see you out in the cut. But uh, have a great Easter, everyone, and I'll see you soon. See ya.